Assalamu alaikum. Today we'll solve exercise 45A from Mathematics 1. We know that if we want to convert kilometer to millimeter, then we have to understand the few formula. That is one kilometer equal to one million millimeter. That means after one, we have to give six, zero, one, two, three, four, five, six. Then hectometer, it will be five, zero. Okay, that means one lakh decameter, one decameter equal to 10,000 millimeter, one meter equal to 1,000 millimeter, one decimeter equal to 100 millimeter, one centimeter equal to 10 millimeter. So if we want to understand this one properly, then we have to think about in this way. We can memorize this one in this way, KH, DM, DCM, okay? If we know this formula properly, then we can easily solve it. Kilometer, hectometer, decameter, meter, decimeter, centimeter, and millimeter, okay? In a similar way, if you want to convert millimeter to kilometer, then we can convert by using this formula. Here, one kilometer equal to one kilometer, one hectometer equal to one by 10 kilometer. And in this way, we can easily find out one millimeter equal to one by one million kilometer, okay? Now, we have to start our exercise. Look at first question. First question says, express the following quantities in kilometers. Number one, three kilometer, three kilometer, seven meter, four centimeter. Here, we have to convert this into kilometer. Look, here already kilometer is given. So we don't need to touch. We have to just convert it. Meter to kilometer. To understand it this way, we can write this formula. H D M D C M. Okay. Now look at this. From kilometer to meter, kilometer to meter, we have three letter. One, two, three. That means we will divide this seven by three zero. Three zero means one thousand. Okay. We'll understand in this way. That is the better way to understand. Plus four centimeter. Look from K to C. One, two, three, four, five. So we will divide this four by five zero. That means one lakh. Then every number will be converted into kilometer. Then what will be the final answer? Look, that is very simple. Three plus seven by 1000, that will be 0 0.007. If we convert this fraction into decimal, then we have to think about the zeros. If we divide by three zero, then after point, we have to give three digit. And the digits will be filled up by the numerator. So it will be 0 0.007 plus here one, two, three, four, five, five zero. So we will give four zero and another zero will be replaced by four. Okay. Now what is the final answer? Three point zero zero here is seven. Then this zero will be there, zero four. Then three point zero zero seven zero four kilometer will be the final answer. So if we convert three kilometer, seven meter, four centimeter into kilometer, then the answer will be this one. Very simple. Now, number two. Number two says two centimeter, three millimeter. Two centimeter, three millimeter. So if you want to convert centimeter to kilometer, then we have to divide this two by how many zero? One, two, three, four, five. So five zeros, that means one lakh, okay? And if we convert this millimeter into kilometer, then we have to divide by six zero. So it will be one million, one million, okay? Then two by this one, it will be zero point one, two, three, four, four, zero and two, four, zero and two. Plus we have to write in this zero point zero, 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 zero. And another digit will be replaced by three. Then after adding, we'll get our final answer. What is the final answer? 0 0.00023. And it will be converted into kilometer. Now number three. Number three says four meter, five decimeter, six centimeter, two millimeter. Four meter, five decimeter, six centimeter and two millimeter. Okay, at first we have to convert this meter into kilometer. Kilometer to meter. So we have three letters. So we are dividing this four by 
1000 that is 30 plus 5 decimeter so from k to d we have 1 2 3 4 four letters so we'll divide this 5 by 40 40 four means 10000 10000 plus 6 centimeter from k to c 1 2 3 4 5 so we are dividing this 6 by 50 how many zero 50 then millimeter 1 2 3 4 5 6 so we are dividing this 2 by 6 0 3 4 5 6 okay then what will be the final answer then we have to convert this fraction into decimal then it will be 4 by 1000 that would be 0 0.004 plus 5 by 10,000 that would be 0 0.0005 plus 6 by 1 lakh that will be 0 0.0006 plus 2 by 1 million that will be 0 0.0002 and 2. Okay, then after adding we'll get our final answer and what will be the final answer? That will be 0 0.0045 62 kilometer. Okay. Then it will be converted into kilometer. Very simple. Now number four. Number four says four meter five millimeter. Four meter five millimeter. To understand this one properly, we have to think about this formula K H D M D C M. Okay, so meter to kilometer, that means one, two, three, three letter. So we are dividing this four by three zero, four by three zero, that means four by one thousand. Okay, now five by what? One, two, three, four, five, six. So we are dividing this five by six zero, that means two, three, four, five, six, six zero. Okay, then we have to convert this fraction into decimal. 4 by 1000, it will be 0 0.204, 004, plus 5 by 60, that means 0 0.5050 and 5, okay? Why 5, 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and this 0 will be replaced by 5, so 0 0.505. And after adding these two numbers, we will get our final solution, 0 0.004. 005. So 0 0.004005 kilometer will be the final answer of this problem. Now number five. Number five says three meter, three decimeter, two centimeter. Okay. Now look at this. If we want to convert decimeter into kilometer, look at this. Then we have one, two, three, four, four letters. So we are dividing this 3 by 40 that means 10,000 plus we have to divide these centimeter 2 centimeter by 1 2 3 4 5 5 0 so 2 by 5 0 1 2 3 4 5 5 0 okay then we'll get our final answer 3 by 10,000 that will be 0 0.303 okay plus 2 by 1, 2, 3, 4, 4, 5, 0. So 0 0.40402. Okay. Now we have to add. If we add, we get our final solution 0 0.00032 kilometer. And that is the final solution of number 5. That means if we want to convert 3 decimeter to centimeter into kilometer, then it will be 0 0.30032 kilometer. Very simple. Now, number two, number two says, express the following quantities in kilograms. So, how can we convert? Look, three kg, four gram. So, we have to convert it into kg, okay, kilogram. So, three will be there, okay. And four gram, four gram is four by 1,000. Because we know that one kg is equal to 1,000 gram. So if we want to convert this gram into kg, then we have to divide this 4 by 1000. Then it will be converted into kg. Then we will write in this 3 plus 4 by 1000, that means 0 0.004 kg. Then final answer should be 3.004 kg. Okay, very simple. 
Now, number two. Number two says 5 kg 44 gram. So, 5 kg. If you want to convert this gram into kg, then we have to divide this 44 by 1000. Then what will you get? 5 plus 0 0.044 kg. Okay. Then final answer will be 5.044 kg. And that is the solution of number 2. Now, number 3. Number 3 says 7 kg. 7 kg. 148 gram. We know that. 1 kg equal to 1000 gram. So we have to divide this 148 by 1000. Then all values will be converted into kg, kilogram. Then 7 plus 148 by 1000, that will be 0 0.148. And all will be converted into kg. Then final answer should be 7.148. So 7.148 kg will be the final answer of this problem. Now, 2-4. Two, 2-4 four. Two, four, is 4 kg, 4 kg, 29 gram, 29 gram. Look, 4 kg. So, 4 plus 29 divided by 1000. Why 29 divided by 1000? Because if we want to convert this gram into kg, we have to divide it by 1000. Then it will be converted into kg. Then, if we want to convert this fraction to this mode, then it will be 0 0.029 kg. Then, or what will be the final answer? Final answer should be 4.029 kg. Okay, very simple. Now, number five. Number five says 172 gram. 172 gram. So, if we want to convert this gram into kg, then we have to divide this 172 by 1000 then it will be converted into kg. So, what will be the final answer? Final answer should be 0 0.172 kg. Okay, very simple. Now, number three. Number three says, add together 6 meter, 5 centimeter, 4 millimeter, and 3 meter, 6 decimeter, 4 millimeter, and express your answer in centimeter. Very simple. So, how can we solve it? At first, we'll write in this meter, then decimeter, then centimeter, then millimeter, okay? First of all, we have to write in this way, 6 meter, 5 centimeter, 4 millimeter, and 3 meter, 6 decimeter, and 4 millimeter. Then we have to add these two values, okay? Then what will you get? Look, first of all, if we add 4 plus 4, it will be 8. Here, only 5 is there. In this column, only 6 is there. Then 6 plus 3, that will be 9. Then we can write 9 meter, 6 decimeter, 5 centimeter, and 8 millimeter. Okay? Now, we have to convert these values in centimeter. So, how can you convert? Look, if we know KHDM, DCM, this simple formula, then we can easily solve it. Look, from meter to centimeter, meter to centimeter, only two letters are there. So we multiply this 9 by 100. So why we are multiplying? Because from meter to centimeter, we know that 1 meter equal to 100 centimeter. 1 meter equal to 100 centimeter. So 9 meter will be 9 multiplied by 100 centimeter. Okay. Oh, excellent. Now, next one. 6 decimeter. From decimeter to centimeter. Then, we have to multiply this 6 by 10. Why? Because we know that 1 decimeter equal to 10 centimeter. Okay. So, we are multiplying this 6 decimeter by 10. Then, it will be converted into centimeter. Now, 5 centimeter. This, this is already in centimeter. So, we don't need to touch it. Plus, 8 millimeter. We know that 1 centimeter equal to 10 millimeter. Then, what will be 1 millimeter? 1 millimeter will be 1 millimeter will be 1 by 10 centimeter. So, 8 millimeter will be 
8 by 10 centimeter because we have to convert our answer in centimeter. That's why we have to divide this 8 millimeter by 10. Then it will be converted into centimeter. Now we have to calculate it. 9 multiplied by 100, that is 900. 6 multiplied by 10, that is 60. Plus 5, plus 8 by 10, that will be 0 0.8. Then what will be the final answer? 900 plus 60 plus 5, that will be 965.08. If we add just, then it will be 965.8 centimeter. Okay, because we are converting our answer, that is this one, into centimeter in this way.